Let me tell you a story. It was 5.30 in the morning. I was fueling up at a truck stop just off I-40, sipping my coffee, boots crunching on gravel, when a Peterbilt rolled in, trailing a thick, nasty cloud of black smoke behind it. Heads turned. One guy even muttered, that truck's burning dinosaurs for breakfast. But it got me thinking, what really causes that black smoke? Because here's the thing, it's not just about pollution. Black smoke means your engine is trying to tell you something, and it's usually not good. Hey, what's up y'all? If you're a trucker, mechanic, or just someone who loves diesel engines, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're discussing into what causes black smoke on a semi-truck. And hey, before we dive in, let me know in the comments, have you ever chased black smoke on a rig? What was the culprit? I'd love to hear your stories. Let me take you back to another day, this time in the shop. We had a Kenworth W900 roll-in, classic ride, but it was pouring black smoke like it was in a James Bond movie trying to escape a villain. Driver swore it just started after his last tune-up. Turns out, it was overfueling. Way too much fuel, not enough air. Black smoke is basically unburnt fuel. The engine's not burning clean, and it's showing you every puff of it. Main causes of overfueling. 1. Faulty injectors. 2. Wrong ECM tuning. 3. Dirty air filters. 4. Turbo not spooling right. If you ever smelled that raw, sooty burn, you know it's not just smoke, it's wasted money. You're literally watching diesel dollars disappear into the sky. Drop a comment below if you've ever had to deal with injectors going bad on the road. What did you do? Replace them all or test and isolate? Now picture this. Freightliner Cascadia. Guy comes in, complaining of sluggish power and black smoke every time he climbs a hill. We dig in, and boom, turbo issues. That turbo wasn't building enough boost, so it couldn't pack enough air into the combustion chamber. Too much fuel, not enough air, black smoke all day. Why do turbos fail? 1. Oil starvation. 2. Carbon buildup. 3. Leaky intercooler pipes. 4. Cracked housings. I always tell friends, listen to your turbo. Whining, hissing, or silence when it should be boosting. You've got a problem brewing. Have you ever rebuilt a turbo yourself or swapped one on the side of the road? Tell us in the comments, I know some of y'all have epic roadside stories. Alright, here's a sneaky one. Guy rolls in with a Mac. Truck sounds fine, but every time he pushes throttle hard, it smokes up the road. Guess what, air filter was caked solid with dirt and bugs. Like trying to breathe through a sock full of sand. Not enough air, hello black smoke. Sometimes it's the simple things. Change your filters. Check them, blow them out, don't let something cheap cause you expensive problems. And hey, don't be the guy who never checks his filters until a dot officer points it out. Let me know below, how often are you changing your air filters? Be honest, now here's a tricky one. EGR systems, when your exhaust gas recirculation system fails, or sticks open, it dumps exhaust gas back into the intake at the wrong time, and it messes with combustion. End result, you guessed it. Black smoke, we had a Volvo come in last winter, every time it idled too long, then took off, it left a big puff of smoke. EGR valve was gunked up and stuck halfway. Pro tip, clean your EGR, replace it if needed, a sticky EGR can rob your power and make you fail emissions. I know some of y'all just bypass the EGR entirely, DPF delete, straight pipe, the whole nine. But that's a whole other conversation. Should we do a video on EGR delete pros and cons? Let me know in the comments. Alright, last one for today, bad fuel or incorrect timing. Low quality diesel with too much sulfur or water in it. Poor combustion equals black smoke. Or maybe the fuel injection timing is off, spraying too early or too late. That messes with burn quality and throws black smoke signals out the stack. Don't ignore it, if your truck is puffing black, your engine's struggling. And what starts as a small cloud can turn into big repair bills. So, quick recap. Overfueling. Turbo not boosting. Clogged air filters. EGR issues. Bad fuel or bad timing. All of these can cause your semi to throw black smoke like it's mad at the world. 